George Best was still with us, God bless him. Uh, you'd have had him on, wouldn't you, after that famous of shambolic... Of course I would. Appearance. He's a lovely fella. He, he was, was a lovely a, man. He was a lovely he? man. Yeah, yeah, I, I, never, I never criticised him. It was his father who, who took a poor view and didn't speak to him for some time after, after he'd done show. the interview. Did you know he was getting drunk in the green room? Or was he drunk when he arrived? No, he, he wasn't. He'd had a couple <laughs> in hostility. <laughs> and who doesn't? <clears throat> We've all had a few drinks before this show. <laughs> but um, <laughs> and, uh, the thing is... Uh, I don't know. He must have had <laughs> several swift ones yeah. between the time I left him in hostility. Because you saw him start at the show. show. Yeah, yeah, yeah he was fine. of course. And yeah. then I looked across, I introduced, introduced him, and you could see across the stage at Shepherd's Bush who was coming on. And there he was, and I could see he was swaying gently under the lights. <laughs> And I thought, oh, no. I got him a bit of trouble here. <laughs> and so he, he came on and did what he did. Yeah. And then Omar Sharif came on. And, and Jomo was lovely with him, wasn't he? And yeah. afterwards I said to Omar Sharif, <laughs> I said, I'm terribly sorry, I do apologise. He said, apologise? He said, all my friends are like that. <laughs> <laughs> I must admit, I saw a clip of that, um, I think probably after George had died, uh, that it was mm. broadcast. And I had forgotten quite how... Shocking! It was terribly funny. I mean, his, his eyes he were sparking, and he was having the time of his he life. Didn't make, there was no rancor. No, 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 no. no, no, no. He no. wasn't trying to send me up. He was slightly taking the pee. Yeah. You know, you're yeah. going to say naughty words. Yeah, yeah. that's right. Yeah. And embarrass Terry. Yeah, exactly. And, yeah. and he succeeded. <laughs> uh, and what? And what about? You see, uh, well, I would never name names. We've been doing this show for four years, um, and occasionally there are people who come on, and you know they've had a little sniff of the white stuff. You know, you just know they have. Um, yeah. Oh yeah. Uh, because, you, uh, like you find, you've seen them 15 minutes before. They were fine. Mm. And they come on, and actually, it's a huge disappointment because when they've had a bit of the white stuff, they don't talk sense. Well, and sometimes you can't do a with them. I used to find that either they went completely over the top and be doing handsprings in front of you, or the eyes would have glazed over, and they'd say something. You'd ask them a question, and they'd go, <laughs> "That's right," and yes. they go, "No," <laughs> and you knew that in their heads yes. they had come out with an absolute. <laughs> Pippin, that gets, uh, you blow your mind with the gag, but it never got past their teeth. <laughs> That's exactly right. Yeah. You've got it in one. Mm, <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> well, OK, well, I should say that it's your show, new show. It's not all um, comparing past with present. You do have, obviously, new guests... Well, I, I try, we try and get a balance. Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. So, yeah. like, if I have three guests, I want to have two retrospectives yeah. and one new person that I, I haven't interviewed before. Because, as you know, I mean, we're up to our armpits. Yeah. In talk shows. Mm. There's yeah. a million talk shows. I didn't want to do another talk show just no. for the sake of doing mm. it. So it's the retrospective aspect of it that appeals to me. It just gives yeah. it the twist. Well, it's and also the bravery of people, yeah, coming including back. myself, coming back for more. Who are prepared <laughs> to look at themselves 20 years ago. <laughs> yes. Because oh, that's God. A Especially for women. Oh, that's my a God. Yeah. Well, and listen, I'm not even a woman. <laughs> <laughs> Wogan, now and then, is what it's called. And it's on UK TV Gold tonight. 10.20, and it runs for an hour, doesn't it? It's an hour, it does. hour. Some yeah. people are calling it Wogan. Not again. <laughs> <laughs> that's what I heard, yeah. Oh, I'm looking forward <laughs> to, to it. Me too. Oh, thank you. Uh, that's it from us for tonight. Tomorrow we've got The Book Club, and we're reviewing Labyrinth by Kate Moss. Which is a terrific read. And the woman once voted the sexist on the planet joins us live. Hollywood's Kathleen Turner. You've done her, haven't you, Kathleen Turner? You've never her. touched her. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> See you tomorrow.